Hey guys, what is up, mates? Here doing another World of Tanks 360 gameplay commentary. We are on Mines in Counter Battle. We are in the Tier 6 Cromwell Medium Tank. You might be wondering why I'm in this tank rather than playing a Tier 9 or 10 like I usually am, and maybe the occasional Tier 8. Well, I got out. I went out and got the Object 140. Uh, I only have, I think, 80k to my account right now. 80k in silver, so I need money. And I have to play a tier where I can reliably make money. I could easily do that in a tier 7 still. Yeah, I could probably do it in a tier 8, more than likely. But I haven't played tier 6 in a while. And I felt like training this crew on the Cromwell up some more. It's going to be a tier 7 match, so... Not exactly an easy match for me, but... Hey, there are far worse matchmaking uh, instances. For a tier 6 medium. Than being placed against tier 7s. They got a 0-1-P. He could meet me up here. An easy A could meet me. I don't have much support, so I don't want to go flying up here. Uh -oh. M5 Stern ain't too eager to try me. Ooh. 3485 tried. Ow. need help. I was right not to make that move. I could have went up there, but I didn't want to test them. I don't want to test either of those guys. Alright, and the M6 is going to be annoying. Back up some. Come on, teammate. Why you got to get in my way like that, bro? Let's get that 90 mil out of the fight. Come on, gun. Don't let me down. Oh, gun! That was on me, though. I aimed center mass with the auto aim. I knew better than that. I got no one to blame but myself. Pretty solid fight here. There's the tiger. Please let his gun be pointed somewhere else. Mmm, bounced. That's on me. Go ahead, try me. Try me, little Stuart. Try me. And the tiger's backing off. Ready to fire on target. Ready to you fire on dirty target. little bastard. Come on! Get the damn Gundam down. Holy shit. Alright, we got him out. Tiger's making a mad break for it. That's right, go for the easy kill, kid. That's right, go for that easy kill. Look at him aiming right at me. What a bastard. Just gotta be patient. Alright, he's out. Now there's a prick hiding up on that hill. And so it was the easy eight. Hmm. I think it could have been that V thirty nine. Match is well in hand. Ah, oh, bounce, get out of here. <coughs> Need that V39 spotted again. Come on, you gotta move, man. Try one more shot. Ten nine, they've pulled it back. He's gonna YOLO me. Not happening, pal. Not happening. Right, we gotta wait patiently. Okay, 
the V-39's out. And that jumbo should be right there. Take an aim, take an aim. Let it aim in. Double whammy. And we got the heavy out of the way. Good stuff, team. Really couldn't, I really couldn't uh, go full all out aggressive. I couldn't be um, insanely stupid or ballsy like I usually am. But you can't take too many chances. And I don't got six cents on this cruise. So you might as well be careful and take your chances. Uh, nearly 1,600 damage. Comet did extremely well with 2,000 damage. Their uh, T-29 did almost 3,000 damage. I feel for him. I've been there. He had uh, almost a top gun. So I... I yeah, I, I know he's got to be pissed. I don't blame him. I'd be infuriated myself, but that's part of the game. Sometimes you got to deal with stupid teammates. Um, very good game overall. Pretty solid game, really, showing from um, the entire team. Our uh, Stug 3 here, he uh, 350 hit points, and he does 1,000 damage. He did outstanding. That's great, no matter how you look at it. Um just, just a solid game overall. Um, Comet did a very good job. 2,000 damage. Pretty much, I had to hold my position, which is kind of uncharacteristic from the Cromwell. You expect to be doing a lot of flanks, a lot of aggressive maneuvering. In any case, um, sometimes you got to play the position, um, even with a tank that isn't really well known for it, like the Cromwell. All right, guys. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.